geometrical work. You can see right there all these vertical tubes or lines. But the essence of all of that is the fingers and the fingernail. There's a finger right there. And there's another fingernail right there. It's just incredible how they can... Wow, man. The whole space. I mean, they go diagonal. I mean, if I didn't know about this, I would never guess how these entities are able to to travel among the around the solar system and beyond. This is universal. The symbol of the finger holding the thing in space is what it is. It's holding a cylindrical object, which is this thing right here. You can see the, 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 the hands. Look, check this out. I made it too big. Fingers, two fingers, three fingers. is captured by this electromagnetic structure that look like fingernails, like a hand. Now it is a hand. Look at that. <clears throat> When you study the image, look at that. So not only that, the hands goes the other way too. And you can see the fingernail right there. The index. Smaller finger. Maybe you become uh, good at this. The more you do, the more you find them easy. 
So there's a fingernail right there for the other finger. And there's the pinky finger right there. Now, one thing is for sure that this hand thing shows on every planet, every moon that I already study. It's just hard to grasp. You have a, a ear cap releasing the other. Look at that. This is what the whole thing is about. And holding a thing, and that's a, 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 a moon, a, a, a strange shaped moon, but it's full of structures. You can see all those strange structures. And the moon itself is one gigantic finger. Look. I'll prove it to you. Look. That is one finger now. And this is a finger. So it's this moon Hyperion. It had all these structures. It had to have people there or entities. Look at the structure. Even with the tampering the NASA did, it's easy to find this. It's just that. Uh, 